Hey, what's going on guys? It's Rod here with the Hodler Fud Crypto, your new destination for all things cryptocurrency. If you're just checking us out for the first time, go ahead, hit that subscribe button, turn on the bell notification and like the content guys. It goes a long way in helping me get out to more people through the YouTube algorithms. It also gives me an idea of what it is you guys are liking for content. So guys, We've been on these hunts for these low cap gens, uh, stuff that has the biggest potential for us to make a lot of money. Also stuff that goes very stagnant in the market or takes a turn for the worse and has a large correction. But the degenerates are what you guys are looking for. So that's where we're going to play again. Uh, tonight we're talking about a project called Anchor and Anchor Token. So... It's a great project, guys. It goes again back with the uh, internet storage through blockchain. So let's hop into it. What is Anchor? Well, Anchor originates as a solution that utilizes shared resources in order to provide easy and affordable blockchain node hosting solutions. It was founded in November in 2017, and during its time on the market, it has built a marketplace for container-based cloud services through the usage of shared resources. This in turn provides developers and enterprise clients with the ability to easily deploy blockchain nodes at a much cheaper price when compared to public cloud providers. As such, hosting blockchain nodes on Anchor take away any centralization issues and single point of failure. Furthermore, public blockchains are able to engage in communities and provide further assistance to their networks. Anchor aims to build an infrastructure platform and marketplace for W3 stack deployment to enable resource providers as well as end users to connect to blockchain technologies and DeFi applications. Note that the Anchor proprietary cloud infrastructure operates independently when we compare it to the public cloud providers, and that it is completely powered through geographically distributed data centers to increase its stability and resilience levels. That's a really good way to just say that they're trying to get data centralized to the people that are trying to access it so that there's higher speeds and, and uh, increased bandwidth. So. Um, really neat project. I really do enjoy the fundamentals and technicals of this project, guys. The neat thing that I really like about it is both the uh, own, like the founder and the co-founder, uh, met while studying at Berkeley in California, and uh, I believe the the one gentleman's name was uh, Chandler. Chandler talked to his buddy Ryan into investing in 2014, they bought 11 Bitcoin and they used that 11 Bitcoin to fund their startup Anchor and look where they are today. So what makes Anchor unique guys? Well, the Anchor network is created to provide a new blockchain solution that leverages idle computing power from devices and data centers as a whole. It is a platform that enables the sharing economy where any customer can access resources at a more affordable rate while also providing enterprise with the ability to monetize their space computing power that is not being utilized. It is unique in the way that it's the first one to use trusted hardware and as such ensures a high level of security. So we've talked about a bunch of other projects that are starting to offer the same type of stuff with uh, data sharing and and allocating resources that you're not using onto the blockchain to, uh, for users to get into. Um, but just a solid little project. I like the backstory, how they used a, a cryptocurrency investment as their startup seed. Um, it's really, really cool, guys. So the, the technicals all point to a great market, uh, you know, we all want to jump on here. We want to talk about what we think price is going to be and where it's going to go. Like I said, 
Anchor is more of a stable platform because it has exposure through the Coinbase network. So you have a lot of retail investors that really don't know uh, exactly what they're looking at. They go on to Coinbase. It's really easy to get money onto the uh, market to start purchasing stuff. And as you start skimming through and reading uh, the little write-ups on Coinbase, uh, it's really easy to start liking projects there. And with Coinbase having the exposure it has right now, you're gonna see a lot of retail investors coming in and just buying projects that they're not really sure what they're doing. Um, this is really uh, evident with some of the other stuff like Civic. We saw big pumps through Civic in and around the Super Bowl time, uh, right around the same time that those rumors of uh, Coinbase's IPO was going in for, for are getting approvals. Um, so, uh, solid projects, solid fundamentals, uh, setting up for a great price entry as uh, it's going to go through and test some stuff here. Uh, but let's flip over. So, Anchor's website here shows a plethora of uh, partnerships. Um, you know, with Polkadot, Avalanche, Binance, Clio, Blockstack, Cosmos, Elrond, like a ton of um, partnerships, you know, Tron, Matic, like th this is interconnecting everything back to blockchain, guys. Um, Anchor's now coming out with staking. You can now make money on staking your ETH2 with them. Um, so there's a ton of upside to where this project can go. Uh, just with the ability for it to stake on its own mainframe versus and and actually go out and connect to other wallets and stake there as well. Um, I really do enjoy uh, when there's a great list of partnerships, just like what we have run through there. And I really do enjoy what Anchor has written up here. Sorry, on their white page here in the overview, it says, Here at Anchor, we make infrastructure that helps in easy accessible, affordable, and instantly distributed deployment of any blockchain node across the globe. They currently have three different lines of business, staking nodes, which are one-click solutions for staking nodes with rewards, earning possibilities. Developer APIs easily build Web3 products with instant API access to major blockchain and DeFi protocols an enterprise solution which offers a turnkey infrastructure solutions for cryptocurrency exchanges, staking platforms, data analytic providers, and more. So it all goes into just pulling back the, uh, the layers here, guys, to give you a look at what they're dealing with is a ton of partnerships. They're across multi-platforms. They offer staking. They're um, absolutely going to go on a rip here shortly. I think if we look at the technicals, uh, we don't have any news pushing it right now, but we've always got social media and stuff like that pushing this kind of stuff, but it doesn't have the big news story. If we jump on here and we look at the charts tonight, guys, you'll see that uh, at the end of March, um, Anchor hit an all-time high of 22 cents, 22.7 cents, I believe it was. And that is where we were back up to um, late last night. Uh, we saw Anchor get back up and test that uh, price again, but it was instantly rejected. We went back to an old level of resistance and we've now started to use that to build support. And that's the yellow line that runs through the middle of our diagram here. Uh, and then we at the very bottom have some support and resistance. And that's kind of that channel that if this moves directly sideways, we expect that we want it to stay in if it's not going to move up or down. Now, if you see the purple arches we have here, we've got an inverse head and shoulders. And then we've also got a double bottom coming out on the right hand side and that's where it ran up to test that all time high immediately was rejected bounced back and forth on the all time high uh, for almost almost today and then was rejected down and now what I can see happening is it comes down and it makes this teacup formation and comes up and shoots up I'm going to guess uh, my drawing shows 49.41% or 
or a new all-time high of 27 uh, point nine one cents so once we get in and break through that new all-time high of around 27 cents watch for this thing to queue itself up to join the rest of the altcoins in the bull run we could easily see a one dollar anchor by the end of this bull run that's a four x on our money guys that is a big gain for us. So watch for something like that to come out in the next uh, run on this alt season. That's what Anchor's looking at right now, guys. That's what I can see. These are my opinions. I'm not a financial advisor. This is my own research, my own thoughts. Um, just a, a, a great, there's been a couple of requests for it. Uh, but it's always been something that's been on my radar of things that I wanted to dive into and look at a little more. I'm not invested in Anchor, um, but I'm, I'm not seeing any reasons not to be invested in it as we've talked about data solutions being a big part of blockchain. Um, so that's what I've got for tonight, guys. Thanks again for all the support. If you guys are liking the videos, go ahead, hit that subscribe button. Turn on the bell notifications and like up the videos. Go back and watch a few extras. There'll be two coming up right here when I say, remember to protect yourself, don't wreck yourself. Hodler Fud, over.